Jesus, why don't we Just lift your hands and tell him thank you. Glory be to God in the highest. Below my country, get privileged to come your way again. Not as one that has attained, but as one that has been ordained to be part of God's end time army. And I'm trusting that God's word away today will be a blessing to us in the name of Jesus. Lord, let your word touch lives. Let your word transform lives. It is your word and not mine. Let it do that which only you can do. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. You are blessed. Welcome to another edition of Royal Body Encounter. Welcome to another series as we look at Godliness guarantees the wholeness, part five. Amen. Beloved, barriers are real, but breakthroughs are real. And the good news is that breakthroughs are superior to barriers. Causes are real, blessings are also real. And the good news is that blessings are superior to causes. Limitations are real, divine interventions are also real. And the good news is that divine intervention is superior to limitation. Let me hear you loudest hallelujah. The choice is yours. Barriers talks about barricades, blockades, obstacles, hurdles, oppositions, war that have been enacted and fabricated to cause a limitation in our lives and I'm trusting the Lord today by his word we shall be set free Genesis 49 verse 10 scripture said Jacob speaking Reuben thou art my firstborn in other words by position he was first my might he was not a weakling the beginning of my strength oh my God the excellency of dignity and the excellency of power. By characteristics, Ruben was a great man. By characteristics, Ruben was a noble man. He had all it took for him to reign, to be supreme, to be above all of his brethren. But the next verse came saying, Genesis 49 verse 4, Unstable as water, thou shalt not excel. It is possible to be well endowed, yet there are limitations and barriers facing our lives. It is not about what we have, it is all about the forces that are powering our lives. Repent, you are dignified, you are noble, you are excellent, you have might, yet you are unstable as water. Scripture speaking about Nehemiah, Nehemiah was a great man, but every but that has become a barrier in our lives, the hand of God strokes them out in the name of Jesus. The hand of God struck them out in the name of Jesus. For so many years, Ruben lived as an unstable man. His generation was unstable because of what Jacob pronounced upon him. Moses speaking in Deuteronomy 33 verse 6 said, Let Ruben live and not die, and let not his men be few. He took a word to bring barrier into his life. He took another word to bring stability and preservation upon his life. God's word is sharper than to a sword. I pray that God's word will locate us today and bring cure for every issue that we are contending and bring freedom over every issue that we are contending in the name of Jesus. It is not about what we have. It is about the God that is fighting for us. Hallelujah. Scripture said in Luke 7, verse 1, from verse 11, Luke 7, from verse 11, that Jesus came unto a certain place called the gate of Nain, and he found a widow that had just lost her only child. At a time she lost her husband. We are not told of other relatives she may have lost. Now the only child she had has been taken away from her. And Jesus stepped into the scene. Oh, Makayata, thank you, Lord. The Lord is stepping into the scene. The Lord is stepping into our case. 
And the scripture said, Luke 7, 13. And when the Lord saw her, he had compassion on her and said unto her, Weep not, virgin, weep not, weep not. John the beloved was weeping because there was no one to open his seal and to read the content of the book. But the angel said to him, Weep not, beloved, there is a hope for us. There is a hope for us. That is why our anchor scripture for this series is 1 Timothy 4 8 for bodily exercise profited little but godliness is profitable unto all things in this season the God of heaven we have compassion on us and activate restoration in the name of Jesus God speaking to Joshua Joshua 1 says be of good courage be of good courage be of good courage Makayata. be strong in the lord and in the power of his might joshua 6 1 now jericho was truly shut up because of the children of israel no one went out and none came in the children of israel ought to have passed through jericho because god has ordained them to pass through that land. And the Bible said the inhabitants of Jericho shut their gate so that the children of God could not make advancement. And what happened at the end of the day? God showed up in his mind. Every barrier that has been erected, every gate that has been closed to reduce our progress in life and to tie us to one spot. The fire of God is released over such gates. Every question that has been released, every question, every machinery that has been fashioned against our progress, the fire of God is released over it today. In the name of Jesus, 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 it is our day of settlement, it is our day of freedom. And when God was through with the inhabitants of Jericho, that gate that they closed fed and flat, the wall that they rested on fed and flat, whatever is a source of confidence to our enemies. The God of heaven is puncturing it now. He's puncturing it now. He's puncturing it now. Let me hear your loudest amen. Let me hear your loudest hallelujah. All we need to do is to seek first his kingdom. Beloved, barriers are real, virtues are real, and virtues are superior to barriers. My God, curses are real, but blessings are real, and blessings are superior to curses. Limitations are real, but divine intervention is also real, and divine intervention is superior to limitation. All we need to do is to seek God first. Beloved, open up your mouth and say, Lord, give me the grace to be godly. Give me the grace to be more godly, to put you first in all. My our intellect is not sufficient to unravel the mysteries that are happening around us on a daily basis. But if we can lift Jesus up in that situation, he will lift us out of every confrontation. In the name of Jesus, you are blessed. Amen. Give God praise. If you've not accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior, say with me to this Jesus, I confess my sins. Become Lord over my life. In Jesus' precious name, we pray. Amen. Over the land of Nigeria, over the land of Edusti, over the continent of Africa and the rest of the world. Lord, preserve your very elect in the name of Jesus and let your word have recourse. Jesus, my Lord, we pray. Amen. See you away. Come your way again with another edition of Rainbow the Counter. Don't forget, you are not a local champion, you are a global wonder. You are not a low ranger, you are a high flyer. Your condition is not your conclusion. Give God praise. Amen. Hallelujah.